The first one we're going to take a look at is the Phoenix LD30. This is going to be kind of our baseline uh, light here, which ranges from 30 lumens all the way to 1600. So this is 30 lumens, uh, not, as you can see, not, not real bright, shining on some, some trees in the distance there. And we're going to cycle through, and uh, that would be maximum brightness, uh, claiming something like uh, 200 meters and change of throw at maximum 1600 lumens. So that's that baseline and we're going to take a look at some of the lights here as we go. Next up is the Phoenix TK22. This is their tactical light claiming also 1600 lumens uh, and it starts a little bit brighter but what you're going to notice with this light is the fact that the beam is more concentrated. This one even though it's the same lumen output has a, a distance a throw rating of over 400 meters so even at the lowest setting uh, it is still brighter than a couple settings up on the other one then we've got the next setting uh, and then we'll go up to there which is the third setting and lastly the fourth setting so as you can see the beam the main focus of the beam is very concentrated and then of course we've got the uh, I guess kind of the the secondary uh, beam there but because of this beam this this lights a uh, longer throw we can definitely see way farther away with it than we can with the other lights even though they're claiming the same luminance output uh, there definitely is, is a difference based on the throw distance again this is the phoenix tk22 and we have a couple more now we've got the olight mr2 Pro Warrior, this is the 21700 uh, battery powered flashlight that claims 1800 lumens. Well, starting as low as one lumen, which is absolutely ridiculous uh, as far as low output. But when this thing is, is in low one lumen mode, which you can see is still fairly bright in some ways, uh, it will be powered for 50 days. So then we've got the next brightness setting, which is 15 lumens. Uh, then we go up from there all the way to the 1800 lumens. And that 1800 lumens has a throw distance of 300 meters. So it's kind of a sweet spot in the middle of those two. Um, one thing I've noticed with the MR2 uh, Pro here is that the output is, the light appears to be yellower. Uh, it, and in some ways that's maybe maybe catches more detail in the eye but doesn't appear as bright as a pure white LED but either way that's uh, that's what you get so that is actually at high and to get to the brightest setting with the light off we will do a I believe it's a tr double click it gives us our 1800 lumens so as you can see it's it's pretty acceptable uh, definitely it's not a TK22, but it would definitely be have the brightest, uh, second brightest light and potentially the, the longest throw uh, of, of the, I guess the second longest throw. The TK22 is longer, uh, followed by this, and then we'd be looking at the PD36 TAC. So this is the MR2 Pro Warrior from Olight. Now we've got in our hand the brand spanking new Phoenix pd 36 tack light this is their new 3000 lumen output light uh, that starts down at 30 lumens and will cycle uh, five brightness settings all the way up to 3000 lumens this light has a 274 meter throw uh, at that well at that 3000 lumens so while um, it doesn't appear as focused and as bright as the TK, uh, TK22 the fact is it does actually output a lot more light but you can see at the distance there it's not quite as bright a distance because again that uh, maximum 274 versus the 405 of the TK22 so again this light right here is the Phoenix uh, PD36 TAC thanks for checking this out and more at bcchardware.com